In this video, I will show you how to use GoLogin as your anti-detect browser. So in order to get started, head over to gologin.com and basically what GoLogin does is it helps you create and use multiple accounts across many different platforms. You can see right here, for example, CoinList, TikTok, and other ones are Google, eBay, Facebook, and a bunch more. So in order to get started, just gonna click on download right here. If you click on the arrow, you can also download for Windows, Linux, Google Play, and Cloud Launch. But I I am using Mac so I'll click download for Mac right here and then the download will get started. Now the great thing about Go Login is despite its quite expensive pricing plans starting at $49 per month you will get free proxies with these plans so you get 100 browser profiles for $49 per month along with 100 free proxies. You'll also get a 7 day free trial. So the download has finished so just click on downloads and then open it and then here just drag Go Login into your applications. Then simply go and open it up, so I have it right here. Then it will say, go log in, is an app downloaded from the internet? Are you sure you want to open it? I'll say open. So now it's opening up go login. Now here you can just go and continue with Google or enter your email address, password and confirm your password. I'll just sign up using Google. Then they will ask, what is your main reason for using go login? So managing accounts on Facebook, Gmail, Twitter, etc. data extraction, real estate classifieds, multiple account management for simultaneous execution of ads across multiple accounts or for handling accounts on Amazon, eBay, Etsy, etc. So if it's none of these, you can also click other, but for example, I'll click managing multiple e-commerce store accounts. Then what role do you play in your organization? I'll say founder. Then how many accounts are you planning to have? I'll say 50 to 500. Are you going to use our API? I'm going to click no. Then how did you hear about go login? I'll say Google search. And so then it will take you to go login and you will see you have a trial account with a seven day free trial. Now to get started, you will see you already have a few right here. So I have Facebook, Google, CoinList and LinkedIn. These are just the names. But for this example, I'm just going to click on add profile in the top right. Now here you can go and give the profile in name. You can in overview right here, choose the operating system of this profile. For example, I'll go Windows 11 and then here you can select a proxy. I'll go with a go login proxy from let's say the United States. Now you can pick data center, mobile or residential. For this one, there's only data center. Then you can click check proxy and you will see this one is available. So then I'll click change proxy and now I have this proxy. Now for the time zone, you can fill the time zone based on the external IP. You can add some extensions right here. You can add bookmarks to your browser here and just gonna fill in all of this information however you need it and then click on create profile in the bottom left. So now we have this profile right here. Now the state is ready. So what we can now do is click on the run button right here. Now you can see the server is not responding. So instead I'll click on run on the second one. Maybe it's because I chose Windows 11 and I'm using Mac. But now right here you can see I now have this browser and you will see it has all the bookmarks that I saw in Go Login. And now you just have this undetectable browser and they won't be able to know that this is your browser. And you can just go and use multiple browsers, literally hundreds or thousands of them for whatever you want to go and use them for. Now you also have these files with dropshipping, crypto, betting, Facebook, etc. So that's how you can use Go Login. Now, if you need more accounts, then you can just go and upgrade to one of their more premium plans and you can go all the way up to 100,000 profiles, which is 100,000 different proxies and accounts. So that's quite a lot, but for most people, probably the 100 will be all right. Otherwise, you can also go to the 300 plan. Now, you can also buy proxies from within Go Login by clicking on buy proxy in the top right and then you can buy whatever you want, but you can also use a certain amount for free. So now you know how to use Go Login. If this Go login tutorial was helpful please consider leaving a like and subscribing to my channel with that being said i will see you in the next video